originally coming because we were going to go to Natural Product Expo in Anaheim, but it got canceled Baby because of bugging. coronavirus. The pandemic has begun. Everything's being canned. So we're going to Air One. <laughs> This is, he, I just picked him up from the airport. So like, I don't know, we have no other plans other than eating vegan food, obviously. And shopping. And shopping. But without going to Expo on Thursday, we've got to come up with another plan. I'm chilling, I'm fine. I know. I, I wasn't even that excited to go. Like I wanted to go, but I'm okay with it. <laughs> I was kind of excited, but everything happens for a reason. So who cares? Okay, <laughs> Snickle, where are you going now? See you later. Bye. Ready? <laughs> what are we gonna do first? I don't know, it's big. I asked her if, if um, it was busy today because it's so nice out. She said we're always busy. We're at this garden called Huntington Library and Garden and Gallery Garden. Never we been here. A picnic. Yep, we brought a picnic. And I got my fanny pack on. <laughs> we are tourists to the sea. I'm looking at it. And map. you have a camera. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> You live here. <laughs> yeah. Don't bring food to this place because you're not allowed to bring it in. So you can eat it like here in the courtyard. So we're having a little picnic. I love these containers. Timmy made a salad. We have this popcorn. We have some celery. Dip. I can't wait to try those. These are from Italy. Mm, sound good. And this is from California. And these quinoa puff crisp things with pistachios. Wait, let's see the inside. Oh, it's good then. Mmm. Yum. Cheese is good. It was $16 though. Which is outrageous. That's what it is. And the meat is good texture, not salty. Look, this is what it needs you to do. be saltier. You take a cracker and then you put some cheese. Okay. Yeah. Now split a piece of meat in half. You do it. Actually, this meat's a, this is, look, it's a grown up vegan Lunchables. Yeah. So then we'll squiggle this on, put a little piece of lettuce, <laughs> and then we'll close it with another almond cracker. And now we have a grown up vegan Lunchable. Make me one. Okay. Mmm. What about these crackers? We got these, are these raw? Yeah. Raw gluten free. Oh good. They're healthy. Look how thin this meat is. You can just do this, but Okay. Piece of lettuce. <laughs> Could you imagine having this like at a party? 
Like, here's my canapes. Mmm. <laughs> oh, it's put all in your mouth. <laughs> you realize after the initial bite, you're yeah, you can't eat them. Mmm, delicious. So don't you remember Lunchables when you were a kid? Well, I wasn't allowed to have them, but yeah. I wasn't either. And then the kids that had them and they had Gushers too. Oh yeah, ew, those are nasty Gushers. I know, ew. but when you were like seven. I know. I liked So Delicious. So, So Delicious. Soda bottle gummies. Oh, like the root beer flavor? Mm -hmm. And then they had cherry, grape, lime. definitely one of the coolest places I've been to in this city. Someone on Instagram recommended we come here. So I'm glad I found it because I'm going to come back a lot. here and it's very delicious we just got a little sample so those are also amazing I don't know why Beanfields got rid of the corn chips that taste like Cool Ranch Doritos but they have these now oh that's hot those cheddar crackers oh yeah pop zest I've had the, it's the same it's a I've your, had pop it's like zest, recipe but, yeah but I haven't had that or it's the, the same recipe you have in your book mm -hmm. And we're gonna try this later. My favorite are the chicharrones. Hope this is good. I haven't used it in six months. Get rid of it or donate it. So things kind of look like this. I don't want to say it stresses me out because that's dramatic, but it throws off my mood. I feel like that's not fair. This is pretty fair. Like it doesn't make me want to vlog. Okay, I have my coffee. Orange raw day. I don't feel anything from the pre-workout just yet. She's. About yeah, to go work out. I'm leaving this room now. <laughs> okay, well, we're gonna make some breakfast with this thing I just got delivered to my door. Don't film me in my pajamas. Okay. <laughs> it's the Just Egg Folded Egg Patty. They just sent me a sample. This is not sponsored, but they did give me a sample of the egg. Not sponsored. Not sponsored. We're also using Gardein breakfast sausages and follow your heart medium cheddar slices, the best kind, and country crock plant butter <laughs> is how we will be cooking the egg and Timmy's gonna help me. Oh, and we're also gonna put it on, we only have this, the tartine um, bakery bread that I get at Whole Foods across the street. Um, that's from San Francisco where there's currently an outbreak of coronavirus. <laughs> I hope that we can watch this video a year from now and be like- And laugh? Oh wow, like that was, yeah, like I hope yeah. it's just, it gives me so much anxiety. This is kind of the fun part about vlogging on YouTube is you have this you archive yeah. of like events and things that have happened. So this is a pivotal moment because potentially we could be dead next year at this time. <laughs> and I, I might get stuck in California. I might yeah. just have to move here. See, the helicopters are out. No. Ready to get us. No, let's just make some breakfast sandwiches and then. Okay, so we're gonna toast the bread in the skillet. Yeah, in the skillet with the butter. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and what should like, I start on? The let's, sausages. Let's I'll do start the sausages. Off. I'm gonna use my cast iron to make these frozen sausage patties. Look how, perfect the, look how perfect the size of the egg and the cheese are. Okay, so 
we'll just let those hang out. And then we buttered the toast. And then we're gonna just grill these. Yep. Yeah. Mm. Hear that sizzle? Why can't we get this anywhere? It's all I want. Yeah, every brand, there's already an egg, a sausage, a cheese from different brands. Why aren't they just like all servicing together? There's probably lots of politics involved that we don't understand. But it's possible to then sell this somewhere since we just made it at home. But if Dunkin' Donuts could just add the cheese and the egg. Yeah. Yeah, it feels like. Mmm. And the new Starbucks thing with the Beyond Meat needs to have this just egg pie. Mmm. No. Mmm. I like it on the toast. Yeah, me too. And it didn't need anything else. It's juicy enough. Yeah. Mmm. Then we just woke up. Well, we woke up like it's already. Almost 11. You know what I want with this though? What? Like hash brown breakfast potatoes. Oh, like I had tots. We should have brought those hash browns to Trader Joe's last night. Like the squares. That okay. would make. No, it's okay because now I don't want to get too full. Yeah, I love hash Like this is the perfect amount. If I ate both pieces, I would feel. I would get too full. Especially because the bread's so dense. And I'd be groggy. Like this is just like a light fit. <laughs> a light fit breakfast. A healthy vegan breakfast. You know, I just like, I want to feel light. <laughs> so what are we going to do today? I don't know. What do you want to do? Well. I don't know. We always seem to talk about the next thing we're going to eat while we're eating. Yeah, so we're deciding are we going to eat Monty's today? Or Eagle Rock noodles. Or Eagle Rock Dan Dan noodles at Joy. Or. Or do we want to go to that steakhouse, which I haven't told anyone about, that with the view tonight for dinner? Like okay. have a romantic sunset dinner. At this steakhouse, they serve this trumpet mushroom scallop dish. And it's so good. I was telling her, it's funny because as a vegan, I like going to steakhouses because they always have really good fries mm -hmm. and really good vegetable sides. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, it's not ideal, but you can get good cocktails, good service, and you know, and I always tell them I'm vegan, that they'll, they'll make me vegetable sides and really good fries. And that's what this place does, except they have this one entree. But they have like a vegan so, entree. The mashed potatoes are so good. Which that's ideal. It's like when a steakhouse has a, a killer vegan option that anyone would want to get. And there's a sunset view of Burbank. <gasps> We're going on a date? I think we should go. I should book a reservation. <laughs> you have to reserve at this place. Well, it's nice to go to non-vegan places too when you're in a city like Los Angeles. Because mm -hmm. that's how New Orleans is. Like to take you to like a cool... No, I liked where we went. It's really warm. nice experience in New Orleans. You usually have to go somewhere that's not vegan. I feel like I owe you that because you did that for me. I feel like we went to Crossroads. That was really nice. Crossroads is lovely. That was Timmy's birthday dinner. Timmy's birthday's tomorrow. <laughs> not a secret. I know. I'm gonna like post about it too. <laughs> I don't know why I get weird about birthdays. Mm. Not weird, I just like, you know how some people make their birthday into like... A week and a, a week. month? Yeah, that girl. It's like it's been your birthday for a week. If like, anyone does that and I know them, I don't want to know them anymore. <laughs> Lauren pops off again. You're not ah. allowed to celebrate for a week or a month. You're only allowed to celebrate for like the day before or like, the day after. Chill. I know, people are on one with that. Like, it's my birthday week, like, <laughs> week? You know who's like that? Leo's. <laughs> Aren't Leo's like... What? 
What month is Leo's? What? August? What are you again? Aries? I forget, Leo. Scorpio. You're Scorpio. Oh, you got what? What are you? Pisces. Oh, Pisces. Water sign. I'm... I'm a water sign. I'm a big water sign. I love hot water. That's I'm always trying to find hot water. I also love water. <laughs> Scorpios, you gotta watch them. Oh, yeah. They're hot-headed. Sociopaths are Scorpios. But that's if they're, like, on the extreme end. I'm not a sociopath. I didn't think you were. No, but anyone who's, like, a murderer, a sociopath. <laughs> really? I don't know. This is what they say. Okay, we bought this at Besties. Oh, my God. I hope we like it. I hate reviewing something that I don't like. The so, outside looks good. If I don't say anything, that means I don't like it. Okay, if he doesn't say anything, it means he doesn't I'll be like... The flavor is good. I don't really know what to compare this to. I never, I don't think I ever had cam. The one from Paris is just really creamy. Is this the truffle one? Do you, don't you get truffle? I think it's truffle. What does it say? No, this one's not. Oh. Maybe they labeled it wrong. It's not bad, but. It's not bad, but it's okay. It's not as creamy as the pears. Yeah, the creamy that I'm not getting. Yeah. But the flavor is good. I think on, on a cheese board it would be fun to have I, with crackers, yeah. but like, yeah. the thing is, is it's expensive. It's not like $5, it's 15 What's Brie cost? $10? Is it okay to eat that mold? Yeah. If it's okay to eat it on regular cheese, then isn't it okay to eat it on I know, but cheese? right now as I'm chewing it, my body's like... <laughs> <laughs> So this is like saute greens with quinoa, roasted Brussels sprouts because they look so good. And kelp noodle. I like kelp noodles if they're seasoned correctly. They're pad thai, it's pad thai. Their stuff's usually good though. Yes, we went to Air One again. It's very loud here. Is this raw? No question. It is very cold. This is how I like beer. If I like have an empty stomach. That's delicious. That is so good. If I have so an good. empty stomach and I'm outside and it's in an ice cold bar <laughs> and it's fresh from the tap, then I'll drink beer. That's really good. What brand is that? It's um. Mmm, that's delicious. I wish, almost wish I got that. Really? Yeah, kind of. What do you get? What? The corn almond. <laughs> <laughs> they still look like covered. There's filling everywhere. I can't believe the waffle cones are vegan too. This is literally the best place that exists in Los Angeles. Mm. I'm making a mess. I got cherry hibiscus. I always get what you got though. It's like cereal. Oh, it's so good.
What you doing? Just making a little chicken green bean stir fry. Mm. For our keto breakfast. <laughs> Timmy here is making his own birthday breakfast because I I just didn't do it. <laughs> no, also like don't don't you want to cook like I'm gonna yeah. eat out today and eat out tonight. Yeah. Like I want I like to I wanna cook one meal today for myself. But also this is stuff we didn't end up making that we purchased. We're trying this chicken. See look. You tasted it? Yeah, I taste a little bit of this. And? I like it. It's not mushy. It's very tiny pieces. It, it's chopped up. It reminds me of like how Thai, like Thai cooking does chicken for like mm. lettuce wraps and stuff. Mmm, yeah. Snickles, you know you can't have any of this. You know, Snickles. There he is in all his glory. This is not how I do this. <laughs> I'm traveling. Toasted almonds, chopped chicken, lemon, shallot, garlic. Yeah. Smoky cashew cheese toast. Sourdough toast. Sourdough toast. Gotta have sourdough on your birthday. Do I have to sing happy birthday? No, I get charged if I sing happy birthday. Mm. I, always like, I always like the Simpsons song. Lisa, it's your birthday. Happy birthday, Lisa. <laughs> Lisa, it's your birthday. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday Lisa. <laughs> This is good. This is like an Asian like takeout. Mm-hmm. I apologize if you can't hear us. The traffic's behind the high. I know. Calm down, everybody. Mmm. <laughs> All right. Well, that's what I ate with Timmy. Where? What I ate in a day with Timmy. There's a few things we left out. I know, but they don't need to know that. <laughs> yep. This is all we ate. We left out my leftover stir fry dinner that I made and like I had like six juices from marijuana <laughs> okay. add that to the list six juices from marijuana that pop leftover noodle Did stir fry I think they saw us tasting the popcorn but you mm, get the gist we didn't of really it. see our crossroads dinner and that was lovely yeah but anyways thanks for watching guys yeah did you know that he has a YouTube channel I guess guess what you can tap the bell and subscribe. I always wanted to say that. Tap the thumbs up, subscribe, and tap the bell. <laughs> what thumbs is it? Leave a thumbs up, a comment below, and make sure to subscribe and tap the bell to be notified when I release a new video. That's a lot. Just subscribe to, you can subscribe to my channel. It's Mississippi Vegan. Yeah, obviously I put it in the card here. I feel like most of here, you- Here, here, I don't know where it is. <laughs> yeah, tap right. <laughs> <laughs> Tap right here. I never know what corner to point to. <laughs> anyway, go watch. It's really fun. And you have how many subscribers now? I have like fourteen thousand. Yeah, close to fourteen thousand. So Woo. join me on my plant-based adventure. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Bye bye. <Cut. laughs>